Hey everybody, the Bonga's back. Welcome to part 16 of Let's Play Brain Lord, brought to you by GameAnyone.com. Okay, I decided to come back to this room over here, using a warp gate. Apparently, I was supposed to go to the door to the northwest, which I had no access to at the time because I didn't go in and out of this room enough times. Alright, so this will get a little bit easier now that I'm pretty much on the right path now. Taking the land dragon key. I believe I have to go all the way back to the northeast. So, why don't we go there? Which I cannot do. Apparently I'm completely locked in. And now I'm not. This place is royally messed up. <laughs> Try to get to the northeast door, if possible. Please let it be possible at this point. And it looks like it will. Which is great news for us. That way you won't have to see this over and over again. If I miss it just by one rock, I'm going to be pissed. Oh my god. Oh, wait, wait, there's an opening. Found it. Okay, we're gonna make it. I'm not sure if this is the way I have to go. Wait, let me go back to this room again. And this time use the x-ray glasses. Because maybe there might be another room I have to go to. Um, doesn't look like it actually. Oh, maybe I do have to go all the way to the right. Let's try that out. I'm just not 100% sure on where it is I have to go. Because these rocks just make it so damn difficult to navigate. You think you're going the right place? Oh, wait! You can't get there at all! Oh, you can't go back either! You're trapped! There's a chance that can't happen! The Rock Breaker? Please tell me it destroys those rocks. Can even shatter stone? Well, my attack power will drop tremendously. Oh, I can't destroy those rocks. You're breaking my heart, game. Then it's not much of a Rock Breaker if I can't break those rocks. Damn it. So maybe I was supposed to go over there. But how can you just tell these days? Just the same amount of damage as the heavy maul. So may be no point to put it on. But I'll keep it. Just because. I mean, I should get used to using an axe more often. Rather than constantly have to phase out. Go back to that first locked door we saw when we went back down to the second f or first floor. Okay, I'm back. I apologize for that abrupt interruption, but my sister and her boyfriend just came back from a little, you know, getaway for a bit. It wasn't for like a few days, it was just for a night, you know, just to have some time together. You know what I mean. I'm not going to explain what they were doing because I didn't ask. A, it was none of my business, and B, repeat A over and over and over again ad infinitum. That's all you need to know. That being said, now that I got that key, I should head back to that door that I saw earlier that I wasn't able to open. So hopefully it's the right key for the right door. Because I'd really hate to come here, find out I had the wrong key, and now I have to go back to this rock maze and look for another one. We don't want to go through that, do we? Of course we don't. And we got a Sky Dragon key! We went through all that to find a key which opens a door to another key. What a waste of effort. You know what? This rock breaker is pretty much useless. If it can't destroy the rocks, what's the point of having it? Seriously. 
Is there any other stairway that I can go to around here? No. So it looks like I have to go all the way back to that damn rock maze. Give me a moment or so. Okay, I finally made it back to the rock maze, and hopefully I come to terms with why some people who play this game actually end up quitting. Like, some of these dungeons are very frustrating, don't get me wrong, I can totally relate to that. Especially this one. Now the question is, should I be going this way? Will it open the other door that could be locked? That's what I'd like to know. Oh, I was already here! That's where I got the damn rock breaker! Hey! Oh my god. Alright, so... What if I just stick to the south? I guess I can give that a try. Remember, I went all the way to the northwest to get a key in the first place. Oh my god, now I have to find a way around. I don't know if the rocks reset whenever you leave the room, or you just have to walk a few paces. Hmm, don't think I've gone this way. Nope, this is new. The silent stones disappear as time passes. There is no road to the jewel. Come back again. There isn't. So I guess I just have to return until there is a path. Yes, there is. There is a road to the jewel. That sign is lying to me. The lightning bow? Is it any good? Compared to what I got? Uh, attack of 10? I mean, I can hit enemies from a large distance, but I can already do that with the uh, maul. I can whack people with the maul. That's gonna be a joke forever. I'm sorry, guys. I mean, if I use the bow, at least I don't have to worry about numbness. That's pretty much the only thing I got going for me. Ah, damn, the stun has got to me. Uh, should I head all the way back to the first floor? Because I'm starting to think that's what it should be. I really can't think of anywhere else I can go to at this point. Unless I went all the way down. Did I go all the way down before? And was there a door? I have no idea. I'm trying my best to remember. I think down there there might have been just one treasure that I probably already got. But let me check anyway, just to be 100% sure. I'd hate to leave something behind. Especially if it can help me. I don't want to come back here, but I just wanted to move a little bit. To see if the path would be clear. Nope, I just boxed myself in almost. Funny how that works, not. Okay, now we're free. And then can I work my way down? Because I can't get, get up. And it looks like I can't get down either. Oh wait, maybe I can get down. I don't know how many people that play this game even got to this point. Or anybody that's watching this video have gotten to this point. I'm sure some people actually have. I mean, it's not impossible to beat this game. It just takes a lot of effort, a lot of timing, and a lot of luck. Okay, it looks like we can finally go this way. Oh, this is for goddamn water. And I'm pretty sh sure, yeah, it doesn't recover poison. Do I have more than one warp gate? So if I do, I'm gonna consider using one. Yeah, I got two left. I think I gotta go back to the first floor. I mean, I'm thinking, I'm not 100% sure. There might have been a locked door that way. I mean, at least I got the ice magic to navigate around. Huh, let's see. There's like five doors, really. Either one of them would be acceptable, I hope. So 
Can we just go back to them? Well, this will work. It'll save me a lot of grief. Okay, there's like three doors. Yeah, none of them are locked. That one doesn't work for me. Let me go back, see if the coast is clear. No. Oh, maybe these rocks are fixed. Nah, no, they're, they're pretty sure it's not fixed. Uh, now where can I find a locked door? Right here. Hmm, trying to think. Which one leads to the locked door, and which one leads to where I just was? I think it would have been easier just to use to go to ruins. I mean, Druk 2, and then go backwards. A little something to think about in retrospect. I mean, hindsight's 2020, right? Can't always guarantee you're gonna know what to do at the very instant. It's after the fact when they tell ya. Okay, so it's the other way. Just go to the far right, Bonga. That's all. If you can get there, might take you three million tries. And then afterwards, you're gonna be trapped. That rock formation is almost like a middle finger house anonymous. It really does. I mean, look at it. I mean, sure, it looks like it's cut most of the way. Anyways, let's try this again. No, nope, it's not gonna work. Maybe I just gotta go in and out. Don't take it the wrong way, guys. Not that kind of in and out. It's probably just a long... Oh, wait, wait. Here we go. I think we're on something. The Rock Breaker just totally disappoints me because it wanted me to believe that I can destroy these silent stones. But you can't. You have to get around them. And that's easier said than done, given how randomly they work. Jesus. Try my best here for you guys. I've gone pretty far back. Maybe it's changed around a bit. If it hasn't, I'll be surprised. Oh, oh, I think there's a bit of a change. If I can get around here. Uh, it's taking me back, but if I just... Hold the right. Like so. This is just taking more effort than it really should, and I apologize for that. Yes, thank you. We're gonna get somewhere new for a change. And I hope we don't have to deal with the damn rock maze again. Because that would really upset me. Okay, a new save spot. Finally. And now we just get over, and it looks like it's just lava. Well, that's not too bad. Is there any other pathways I might need to take? Actually, that's not too bad. You think about it. I mean, there's a lot of paths, but at least it doesn't seem to be a rock maze. I think we can make this work. Let's see where this goes. Oh, it just leads to some treasure. Cheese? Really? At this point, I have a life jade, whose level is high enough that this uh, piece of cheese is worthless. Well, pretty much all my healing items are worthless. Oh, great. Now we got a mudslide. Just something new. That was actually very close. Just gotta watch where the sand or the mud is going, so I don't go into the abyss. Okay, please take me to another key. Or some are awesome. Doesn't always have to be a key. Yeah, I think I should make this jump from here. Wait, you just gotta make sure you make the right jump at the right position and know where you're gonna reach that certain threshold. Otherwise, you're gonna fall. Sea Dragon Key? That's not Kingdra, is it? 
I think it was better just to make that fall. That way I can just go all the way back to the beginning of the room. It won't work here, though. It'll just send me back to where I came from. And that's not gonna help me. I wanna go the other way. I mean, I'd use the warp gate. Ah, damn it. I'd use the warp gate just to come back here. God! Ugh. I'd use the warp gate to go back to the third save statue, but I only have, like, one warp gate left. So if I use a warp gate, it should be over at a town where I can buy more warp gates. It's a very arduous process, I know. But it's gotta be done. So if I don't use a warp gate, I have to leave the long way. And nobody wants that. So that door I saw earlier, will the sea dragon key fit? Let's just use the cheese right now to free up inventory space. And now, let's go to that sea dragon key. It's this one. Good. We're making some progress here. Hope I don't miss any items just by going this way straight up. Ah, oh, finally, I should have killed that enemy. Because it just wasn't letting me use my magic. And I'm pretty close to dying. Who ever thought it would happen so soon? Just keep getting hit by the lava. I don't know where this is going to lead me. Is it going to lead me to more treasure or another set of rooms? I guess we'll find out soon enough. I should really just check the x-ray glasses now. Hmm. Do I really want to go that way? I have a feeling I'm going to miss a few things. I think I should have just gone like to the lower right and see what happens there. You know what? I'm gonna stop the video here, and then the next part, we're gonna go back to the third statue. I'll have more warp gates, and then we'll explore that area. See ya!